back again viewers and this vlog through the videos here today and we're situated in Darleston. Hope everybody's keeping well and enjoying their day and keeping nice and safe. Right then, um, it's been a while since I've been to Darleston but I thought I'd do a, a then and now video. I did last one I think I did was the, uh, the lights one wasn't it, when I did all the Christmas lights. What we're going to do a then and now in Darleston and I'll uh, Look, at, look back at some of the history of Darleston and some of the shops. Right, well first of all, Darleston Town Hall. Used, they used to do uh, bric-a-bracs in there. They used to have little bric-a-bracs uh, or little stalls. And uh, little charity stuff that you could uh, people used to sell. All their gifts and that from home. And uh, yeah, they used to call it a bric-a-brac. For those of you who didn't know. Oh, near the church. Chime in there in the background. Right. We've just come to the main town in Darleston. A bit cooler today, isn't it, viewers? You can feel the uh, chill starting to come now. But we can't expect nothing less as we head into, uh, just head into October. Yeah, it seems to have fled by, doesn't it? Right, now that Turkish barber's there, viewers, that used to be a found shop. And uh, the main street in Darleston is called King Street. Now, along here, I think it was like, a cafe, where the cafe used to be. Along here, we used to have a pet shop as well. Yeah, it's gone. I think it was where the cafe was. I think. Memory serves me correctly. An interesting here, view is where the um, Asda is. We used to have a. Uh, I will put a picture on the screen. We used to have a big. Uh, have like a big square similar to what we had in Wensbury. We used to have loads of shops all round here. Yeah, and um, round here we used to have. Um, I'll put some of the shops on the screen for you to see. We used to have uh, Jowitz. Then we used to have um, a butchers, and uh, we had a video shop up there as well. And it, like I say, it used to be like a bit of a parade, and they used to have all loud the shops. But I'll put some pictures on the screen for you to see. Yeah. Interesting times, though, isn't it? Parade, yeah. I used to. I remember all them shops. I remember the video shop. We used to hire a video and uh, a couple of days. You'd hire a video for a couple of days. Of course, it's all DVDs now, isn't it? Right. You can see the Asda. Oh, there. Yeah, as you can see. Now that coral there. That used to be. Gold supermarket. There, big coral. And it used to have a sign above it called Paul's Pantry, where that white bit there is. Yeah. And they also had there, I think it was where the kebab place was, they had a shoe shop. And we also had uh, a net curtain shop as well. Yeah. Here and now shops there. I think the shoe shop was called City Shoes, if I remember correctly. I used to come here a lot with my nan, because my nan lived in Darlington. So I'm going on just memory. That there used to be Lloyd's Bank. Now Hot and Crusty Pizza and Fish Bar, that used to be Kingston's Butchers. Heron Foods there, that used to be Ethel Austin. Ah, oh, somebody else I've noticed it's gone. Just noticed that. There as well, you can just walk away there, 
they used to have some uh, public toilets up there. Yeah, also there, that cake shop there, that used to be Firkins. And Desi Swart, if I've pronounced it right, or Desi Swart, that used to be Clemmy's, a school uniform shop. That library's been there years. That library. Oh, we're just coming to the end of King Street now. At one point, uh, when uh, because they shut, they shut the shut down at one point, and it was uh, there was nothing there at one point, and there was talk of it being a swimming pool, and then it come back as a bigger, even bigger Asda. down here, show you around here. Up there uh, you got, uh, that takes you to the trade centre, up there, it's about a mile, a mile and a half up the road, come to the trade centre on the left hand side. And this Veg Express Superstore, that used to be Midland Bank. Yeah, it's African Caribbean what shop now. But that used to be Midland Bank. It's lap bang in the middle of the weekend viewers, it's Wednesday, of course, unless you watch it on a different day that is. So the weekend is ever coming close again. Now, before I forget, next week I will be uh, heading to London next Thursday, so I am planning on taking all my equipment with me and doing some filming whilst I'm in London, so I will try and get round London and do a few vlogs there. Takeaway Tuesday will be on the channel as normal here, and then the following one will be in London. I don't think I've done a Takeaway Tuesday in London yet, so it'll be my first one there. Now up here on the left, is it still there or is it gone? I think it's, I'm sure I heard that it had gone. Yeah, that there bit, viewers, that building there, that used to be the police station. That building there on the left. Yeah, Dallas, used to be Dallas and police station that did. See that it's got a police station, but yeah, yeah, you can see. Look, just to the sign there, look, police station. For a second, I thought it was open, but now definitely isn't. Now, that's been gone years, that I think. Oh look that squirrel look. Just see him going across the grass there, look. Oh, there's another one there, look at look at him there. You can zoom the camera. 
It's in there, look at him, he's got some, look. I think he's got some bread, I think. Yes, yeah, some people have been there, putting bread down there for him. Yeah, he's got some bread in his mouth. Oh, look at them two, they're fighting there, look. I know you can see on the camera, now you can't. Those two just chasing each other. Fighting out for that bed, I suspect. Right, then I'm going to end this vlog right now. Thank you very much for watching. Hope you enjoyed that. Hope you all have a fantastic day. Thanks to everybody who subscribed to the channel of late. I really do appreciate it. And thanks to all the lovely comments. I'll see you on the next one and it's bye for now.